Hi, welcome to TGN YouTube channel. I'm Jason. Right, so for today, we have the latest in wall. This is the U6 in wall. All right, I will actually compare it against the U6 in wall HD. Now, in terms of size, some of you are very curious. So, if I were to place it in front, actually, there's still an additional gap. Right, so in our environment and our context, we are using the UK 88 by 88 uh, gang. Okay, I'm going to take a look and explore with you together. Now, let's open up the unit and see what's given this time round. Right, this time round, the unit is slightly more pricey than normal. Okay, uh, as you given that it's a U6 in wall. Of course, uh, definitely, I will power it up and take a look at it and see uh, what's the difference in terms of comparing it with the in wall HD. Okay, now, let's talk about the size. Uh, I'm going to open up my in wall HD. Let's compare the cover. Okay, from the cover, we can see that uh, it's definitely there's a difference in size. Okay, so this is the in wall HD, and this is the U6 in wall. All right, so you can see straight forward. All right, the comparing of the size is at least additional couple of millimeters more. Okay, if you put it on top and bottom, you can of course also see the difference. Okay. Now, from the back, um, it's the same as the Inwall HD. Now, let's talk about the cover. Okay, so for all those who have installed Inwall before, you will know that it actually comes with a back panel, same like this. Okay, now for us in Singapore, we will use the two um, holes here for, to install it on the 88 by 88 single gang. Okay, uh, some of you may buy the dual gangs, okay, so that you can fully cover the whole thing. Okay, all right, so once you have your cable done, all right, so you will have a male and you connect to the female RJ45. So, how it will actually look like, let me show it to you. So, the mount is there's actually a small little clip here, you got to hook on together, and once that's done, you just clip it in, all right and it will be one solid complete unit. Now, um, in this case, one of the major differences that I noticed between the EU6 in-wall and the UAP in-wall HD is this is plastic. This is metal. Okay, this time round, uh, the U6 in-wall is using a metal plate, all right, to hang on to the AP. All right, that will basically let me know that uh, this unit will tend to run a bit hotter. And not only that, the AP itself is actually embedded together with the front cover so it's all together into one as compared to the in wall hd where it's the front cover and there's additional ap okay for the ap itself for this is also made of uh, metal okay as compared to the in wall hd where it's also plastic okay so um, let's see what else is inside the box okay you have your quick user guide okay and of course the screws and also this time around you'll notice that they actually provide a key all right um what i understand is basically it's for you to poke okay okay for you to poke to have again access as a latch all right so do you actually see this key same key also on the ud udr okay that is basically for you to pull out the micro sd card all right so that's the reason for this key okay so for some of you who are curious about this key there is a purpose for it do not lose it and please don't throw it away okay you will definitely need it right as usual, the reset button is at the bottom and of course it's PoE in and PoE out. Now for the PoE in, it's over here, PoE out is on the first port. Uh, you definitely need at least 802.0380, 30 watts of PoE power. Alright, take note of that, especially if you're using the new Gen 2 switches. Um, that's very critical because the PoE um, wattage has actually uh, reduced quite a fair bit for a few of the switches. Right, so make sure you calculate your requirements for your PoE correctly and accurately so you will not run into a case situation where you run out of PoE. Okay, so if you have any questions, uh, please feel free to leave us a remark and um, comment. Um, if you like the video, remember to click like and subscribe to my channel. Thank you very much.